Hey, greetings everybody. This is uh, Sim Samnang. And Samnang, what do you do here in Cambodia? Hello, I'm Samnang. I'm uh, the uh, church planting trainer. And I have been planting churches in uh, Cambodia. Also, now we have uh, a church planting school in uh, two regions. One in uh, Swayden, near Vietnam border. We have 15 church planters over there who work in the different uh, 15 different villages and uh, another one in uh, Simrip and Kodominche. We also have uh, 13 church planters over there to uh, work in uh, different villages uh, in the rural area in Kodominche and Simrip. And so during this uh, uh, lockdown, you're not going out, but what are you doing? So. Uh, as you know, in uh, this situation, in this season, COVID-19 has uh, spread all over the world and uh, the government of Cambodia really uh, try really hard to protect uh, our people and uh, so some areas uh, have been uh, locked down and we are not allowed to gather the people uh, with uh, 10 people or more than 10 people. But um, what we're doing now is uh, uh, just uh, uh, encouraging our church member, our leader, church planter, keep doing uh, what the Lord has called us to do by um, visiting people, but not a lot of people, just visiting one by one uh, people. Yeah. Also. And so you said that you're in the office and so you just make telephone calls and use social media to communicate with uh, all of the church planters that you relate to. Yeah. And you were telling me about the ones in Ottermienche. Ottermienche is on the north of Cambodia along the Thai border, very poor area. Uh, and you said you have a, a group there that's uh, planting house churches. They're, as you said, not going in groups, they're just going one by one to visit. What's, what's the creative thing? You told me about something very creative that they're doing right now. Yeah, uh, in the Dominique is a rural area, like uh, not far from a Thai uh, land border, but uh, during this uh, season, during this uh, crisis. So I'm sitting at home, mostly at home, uh, working on uh, uh, my computer, my phone, calling to uh, uh, try to uh, uh, connect with them. So one day I call uh, a leaders, a church planter leaders in the Dominican Church, and uh, they, they did really amazing thing to help the com their community. So they visit uh, the people that are one by one, and um, they saw the need. So they take the posters on uh, uh, the educated uh, people on uh, protection from uh, COVID-19. They make a lot of copy and uh, post on uh, the village and uh, post on uh, people houses, try to help the people to protect themselves by uh, uh, doing hygiene, like uh, washing hands and wear masks. So we uh, see the need, so we, sending them some soap and uh, chroma. Yeah, so you were saying they don't have soap they don't and they don't soap. have money to buy soap, they don't have mask, and so you got the money together. Yeah, so we uh, buying some soap and chroma to send them and they uh, take the chroma to make mask and then uh, they uh, share the soap to the village, uh, uh, to the uh, villagers there and, uh, and teach them how to wash their hands and uh, wearing masks. So there's the opportunity. They are the opportunity so that they can share the love of God, yeah. share the love of Jesus. And, and, and the how does it to tell them about Jesus? And so how does the government feel about this? The local government? And then the local government there ask them, okay, please, can you go to this village and that village and that village? And uh, to uh, to do all these things. We, really appreciate what you have done. So go to the other village to do so. So we really yeah. appreciate what you have done. So this is exactly what the church is supposed to be doing, not only during crisis, we're supposed to be doing it all of the time. Great, so really proud of you and excited to hear that testimony. We'll share this with the world and, 
and ask them to pray for you and your continued ministry uh, and pray for all the church planters all over Cambodia that you're relating to and that you're training at a distance for right now.